Hello, everybody. Uh, this is Daniel Wiafi with TulsaCheapHomes.com, and we are down here at 511 North Washington Avenue uh, looking at this property. It is a three-bedroom, one-bedroom property that is located in Sand Springs, and let's go ahead and take a quick peek and, uh, and look on the inside. So as we come into here, we're coming into the dining room, and um, as you can see, it needs a lot of cleaning up in it. There's a lot of stuff that's been thrown all over the place. And the previous owner was uh, attempting to make uh, repairs to it um, and gave up on the project. Um, anyways, uh, some vandals, some young vandals, uh, broke into the house a few months ago and uh, put some artwork in here and did some other stuff in here, which uh, you would obviously need to paint over. But this is an otherwise a good house. Uh, just needs to be cleaned up and have uh, some repair done to it. So um, you would definitely want to clean this up and probably replace this carpet. Um, and as we go into here, this next room, we are in the dining room. Um, as you can see, most of the windows in here have been replaced, and they've been uh, uh, the previous owner put double pane windows into them. So that is a plus. And most of the light fixtures in here are new. Moving along. We come into the first bedroom. Um, it's not really considered a bedroom since it doesn't have a closet to it, but um, you can definitely use this as an office or even as a little kid's or a toddler's room. Moving on, we are now entering into the kitchen, and I hope there's enough light in here. Um, the kitchen has uh, new cabinets and a uh, sink, stove, and all of that good stuff in here. Um, obviously, as you can see, uh, the tile is very is uh, in good condition in here. Uh, you just need to shine it up a bit. Uh, you definitely, obviously, need to clean up in here. Um, the only concern that I see is this little uh, hole in the uh, ceiling. The roof above it is uh, good. Uh, this ceiling portion just needs to be repaired, though. And let's move into here, which is the second bedroom. All right, uh, this is where the vandals did the most of their dirty work. Um, you see there's graffiti all over the walls. Some of it will make you laugh if you read it. Um, pretty decent size um, room. It has access into the attic above here. And let's go ahead and move on back here into the kitchen and step down a little bit. All righty, uh, we step down and we are in the third bedroom. And this is the room which is going to be the most working on to it, uh, done to it. Uh, the carpet on here will definitely need to be replaced. It's a little bit damp. Uh, the ceiling, as you can see, has uh, some pretty um, good damage to it. Uh, that will need to be replaced. But as you can see up here, the uh, roof is in a uh, pretty decent condition, but uh, you would need to do some repair to it because uh, the water came in uh, where the uh, new roof addition was put in. So uh, you would definitely need to repair that. All righty, uh, moving right along, we are in the bathroom. Uh, you would need to repair the ceiling in this section of the house as well, um, but this bathroom has a lot of promise to it so you just need to get in here clean it up it already has a tub in here uh toilet obviously you want to replace it and uh, just get a uh, wash uh, stand and a sink put in here all right and coming along we are in the laundry room slash utility room so you will just put your washer dryer in here uh there's hookups for it along the wall as you can see and there is a um, water heater so this is the inside of this house at 511 north washington avenue if you want to see other homes that we have you can check out tulsacheaphomes.com that is tulsacheaphomes.com and uh, let's go ahead and take a look at the outside of the house and uh, just walk the perimeter so we're walking here, it has a, about a medium, small, medium sized front yard. Um, the backyard is pretty huge on this place. 
Um, as you can see, this is the side of the house. So I'll just let you all take a look at here. And right here, the uh, owners put a uh, central air uh, unit back here, and it's uh, unused. So this is uh, a new unit. Uh, moving back here, this section of the house right here is a half basement, and it has an entrance to it from the back right here. Uh, the back has been, the entrance to this half basement has been uh, nailed shut, but I believe it's about uh, 400 square feet or 500 square feet, something like that. So uh, that would add to the square footage of this house. It would push it up to about 13, 1400 square footage total. Alrighty, and let's go ahead and get a zoom out of the back of the house. As you can see, it's pretty large. And the backyard is pretty large as well. So let me walk slowly so I don't trip. And there's a street which uh, runs in the back, which uh, will allow you access in here. And, I mean, you could uh, even uh, park your car back here. Just uh, put a uh, um, gravel down or asphalt down and make yourself a nice little backyard. All righty. So this is Daniel Yaffe with TulsaCheapHomes.com. If uh, you want to take a look at this house, just give me a call back up or visit the website, TulsaCheapHomes.com. The number is 918-574-6125. This property is uh, up for sale, uh, no bidding. Uh, this will make a great investment property or rental for you.